Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Echo. Welcome back today to a Minecraft Pocket Edition 0.16.0 add-on. In today's video, we are checking out the Lucky Block add-on. This was released yesterday. It is so much fun and how rude of this cow to just... Help. Oh, well, I've made friends. I've made friends today. Anyway, Lucky Block guys was originally a mod on Minecraft PC and is now available as an add-on on Minecraft Pocket Edition. Now this is more of a positive Lucky Block. If you guys know about Lucky Blocks, they're normally gold. Well, these ones specifically, they look more like Christmas presents, which I guess is kind of getting us ready for the Christmas spirit. Now, hopefully this does get updated with different types of Lucky Blocks because we normally have like a Lucky Block, a Lucky Lucky Block, and like a, a bad Lucky Block, which gives you unlucky things specifically. So. Thank you so much for whoever created this. There's a download in description. Now, guys, if you do enjoy these add-ons videos, be sure to thumbs it up because it shows me that you want to see more and I can bring you tons more videos like this. So a few things that we need to go over before I show you what this is all about is the reason why I have a nether portal there is because... Go, ca seriously, Cal, get away. Uh, the reason why I have a nether portal there is because this lucky block is, is linked to with the boss, sorry with the skeletons so the question mark i'm holding in my hand is actually a with the skeleton spawn egg so if we go in the creator menu you guys can see there right in the middle of my screen that's a question mark that is how you spawn them now like they do move over a certain period of time like i've left these ones here and they haven't moved however i did have a bunch over here in a line and they kind of moved out just a little bit now these won't attack you so do not panic now the cool thing about this is you can go into the nether and have a little bit of an adventure and because with the skeletons spawn every so often you get a lucky block every so often so it's kind of more of an adventure lucky block anyway we also have here a creeper head and a with a skeleton skull so the creeper head itself is actually a pokemon ball and we've also got here the um a burger i have no idea why they introduced this but it's so it, i don't think you can eat though you can't i don't think you can eat it but they changed it to be a burger which i thought was so much fun i'm loving everybody retexturing a couple of things so we've got here the creeper head and the Wither Skeleton Skull, aka a burger. Like, I mean, it, I don't know. It just it looks pretty fun. Hopefully, someone makes... You know what I'd love to see? I'd love to see a SpongeBob add-on. That would be so much fun. Anyway, so this is the um, the Lucky Block itself. So you spawn them in just by tapping them on the floor. And as you guys can see there, they look nothing like Wither Skeletons. And again, they do look more like Christmas presents. Now, you don't have to break these with a pickaxe as you normally would again the add-ons are really in an early stage so they're gonna get better as time goes by so let's just quickly maybe we can use this if i tap this as you guys can see it breaks it now the loot is very very different that's the good thing the loot is always always different you can end up with some good things or some bad things for example with this one now i think you always get a burger and like yeah i think you always get a burger which is i guess why not we've got gold pants we've got um an iron pickaxe gold axe and a stone shovel with some arrows as well. So the next one, okay. I don't know what the best loot is you can get, but, oh, there we go, we got ourselves a diamond helmet. Got, and the cool thing is, right, every time you break this, you get some XP as well, which is also a bonus. We got a bow, I think that might be a diamond, a diamond pickaxe and also a diamond sword, I think. Let's pick these up real quick, let's check. Uh, we did. We actually did get a diamond sword. Okay, perfect. I'll take that. Wait, do I have any more diamond? Yeah, we did. We got some diamond. I've got so much loot on me because I've been messing around with this a bunch. So let's see what the loot is in this one, and then in this one, and then in this one. So some of the loots are very similar. It looks like we ended up with a lot of diamond chest plates. I haven't really seen any diamond booty so far, but I'm definitely going to take this loot anyway. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to spawn a couple more and just see how we get on. So I'm loading the fact that it's a question mark. For some reason, I don't know why they... Oh, my cow died. That's what he gets for ruining the video this should be like a gold block with a question mark on it i'm not entirely sure why they used like a christmas theme i really don't know so let's spawn in a couple of more then i'm gonna go to the nether and show you guys what's going on in the nether so one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten okay let's see what we end up with here so let's just quickly rapid fire these We've ended up with quite a lot of loot there. Yeah, I love the fact that you get XP. There's a lot of leather stuff here. Also a lot of gold stuff. This, this, I'm loving the burgers though. Like the burger variations, they're so random and so different. But look at them. Like who doesn't want a burger in Minecraft? And also a Pokemon ball. I mean, that's like an extra bonus in there. All right, so 
let's head to the nether. Let's go and see what's going on through here. Now, sometimes this does crash. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't. Oh, it didn't crash this time. Okay, I'm pretty happy about this. So when you find a nether in this, which we're going to have to do a little bit of traveling here to the left-hand side, you're going to come across the fortress, and that's the best place to find wither skeletons. Now, sometimes it takes a little bit of time for them to load in, but you'll see these popping up every so often. So it kind of, again, like I did say, it makes it a little bit of a mystery to explore the... The, um, the nether fortress and you can see some blaze down there as well so I, I, I suggest putting it on like a harder difficulty the harder the difficulty the more that are going to spawn in but let's just see if we can find anyone <gasps> oh that's an ordinary chest <laughs> you know that time when you think you found something special and then you just get your dreams crushed that's just what just happened right there okay well, let's just go up a little bit because it might be a little bit easy if I can explore wait 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 wait, wait. was that something there is there something there oh that's that's not that's because I messed around with that earlier on that's because I was messing around with them in the nether. Um, please spawn just one. I just want to show everybody that they do spawn naturally inside of here. Uh, but sometimes they do take a little bit of time. That's the only downside. Come on, Mr. Wither Skeletons. Where are you hiding? Maybe we'll go back this way a little bit. But I'm sure you guys are going to have some fun with this. Again, this is kind of like phase one of add-ons. By phase one, I mean like it's really early stages of add-ons. Things are going to get better. Oh, there's one. Oh, there we go. There's one. That's an exciting one. Things are going to get better and more exciting as uh, more add-ons are released. So, let's quickly see what you've got. Boom. There we go. We got ourselves some loot. I'm loving the burgers. So, hopefully you guys have enjoyed this. I've done a lot of add-ons recently. Let me know in the comment section which your favorite add-on is so far. Take care. Stay beautiful. And as always, I'll catch you next time. Bye.